Welcome everyone. Blight Nation, what is good? Ian and Vito, and soon to be joined by Liz, which you'll be catching in the live stream. Yeah, sure. Yup, 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 yup. Yep. Yep. But Ian and Vito, we're back again with another black and white reactions. For, yes, another for day, guys. another reaction, another grind, another moment. Now you guys are going to see this same intro repeated a lot over this week. Yeah, so this, new. yeah so this is going to be repeated in a lot of videos. So what we're really doing is we're taking a lot of the videos from the um, live stream, and we're just cutting up and we're putting them out. So pretty much most of our videos for this week are already done. If you want to uh, go, uh, yeah. we got five hour live. If you want to catch it, exactly, feel free. So like, if you see editing and transitioning throughout the video, that's why we're just cutting it up and then putting out the videos for people who missed the live. Right. So, so definitely, if you want to catch everything in the entirety, yep. go catch the live. If not. You guys will catch this nice little snippet from yep. one of our reactions that we did. So right after this, it'll transition right to a video. Mm -hmm. And after that, we'll have a transition of the end of the video. And then ta-da. So enjoy the reaction, guys. Later, y'all. It's, it's good, it's man. Okay, I, hit, I hit the right one. It's I hit the right good. setting this time. Okay. Okay. All right. You know what? So the reaction video is not screwed up. Start the song over. Yes. All right. Okay. Here we go. What's going on, Russ? I love the earth, but I don't really want to save it. Everything is sexist, uh, homophobic, or it's racist. Sweet. When life gives us lemons, we're supposed to want to change it. But my generation up, would rather take some pills than escape it. Say that I'm transphobic if you want to, but one day I'll be a father. And I really hope my son don't grow up to be my daughter. I ain't trying to hurt your feelings. Skin should be a little thicker. That's the problem, you know? Honestly, but see, and then there's people that be mad at him for saying that. I hope my son doesn't grow up to be mm. my daughter. Because there's too many... Kids are so subjective. There's so many people that are just wanting to say they're trans that aren't really trans, even though they're... You know what I mean? The people that are actually feeling that way, that are going through that, are being hidden by the people that are just trying to get the attention. You know what I mean? I do, because oh, yeah. I think no matter what, you're always going to want somebody who... Right. You're always going to have someone who just does something for, like, just to say they did it. E exactly. Right. Which overshadows that. the person that's actually going through that internal yeah, yeah. struggle. I see what you're saying. That's what I see. I think he's trying to get. I, I see what you're saying on that. That does make sense. And there's and there's a generation of parents these days that are hoping their kids want to go through a transition, which is sad. So don't get me. Correct me if I'm. I think this ties into what Tom McDonald was just saying. I saw uh, like a brief article. I didn't really read the article. I'm not gonna lie. I did see. I just looked at the headline. And it was a teacher, I don't, I forget what state or city it was in, but instead of, like, I get it, you pledge allegiance to the flag, and I said, yeah, yeah, yeah. She instead taught the kids, don't pledge allegiance to the American flag. She took that one down and then pledged allegiance to the um, gay pride flag. So I'm thinking... What? I'm like, well, the gay pride flag isn't a country. Exactly. No. So I thought we were pledging allegiance because we love the country. Right. Exactly. Which should be inclusive. Which yes. is inclusive. So I was like, why are you pledging allegiance? Like, that's almost like pledging allegiance to an organization. Not the right. It was just confusing which, which is, to yeah. me. Ridiculous. And, and, and it, it wasn't matter. And it wasn't for like right. high school. She was teaching like fifth graders. Though. That's not good. And I was like, I, I get wow. what she's trying to do. I she's understand. trying to have inclusion. Right, but that's the wrong way to go. But about it's it. like, exactly. I feel. That's pretty much saying you shouldn't have pride in your country. Yeah, so I, I was just I'm like. And it doesn't matter which country, because we know we have fans everywhere. Whether yeah, exactly. America, whether it's France, whether it's exactly. India, whether it's, whether it's Korea, anywhere. It's mm -hmm. like, for example, if you lived in France mm -hmm. um, and. The flag you're pledging in, in the school system there is like I don't, we don't know if you guys I don't yeah I, I don't you'd be able to let us know I, if they pledge so the honey let us know if I'm in, I'm incorrect about that I don't know we just know in America yeah. the, the traditions they so, they have a yeah I'll switch it back I'll switch it back to to, to America because I live in America it's like if we lived in New York mm -hmm. and you're in the school system and you pledge allegiance like you're pledging allegiance but it's the New York Giants flag right and I'm like that's not a country right right so it's like what are you trying to you're trying to teach inclusive like being inclusive i just don't think you're teaching it correctly it's like saying that um be proud of 
the pride. Yes, yeah, that's exactly being, what I was saying. Instead with that. of not, don't be proud of where you live at in the, in America mm-hmm. or where were you born. Yeah, right. That's what it's like. Nobody's perfect, but you should still take pride. In yeah, where you I are. was, yeah. I was, and I and I feel like that tied into what Thomas. I'm like, that doesn't make sense. Mm-hmm. That's like, oh, I pledge allegiance. Like if I'm a if I'm a um being an Eminem fan, I was like, I pledge allegiance to Slim Shady Records. Right. Why would you do that? <laughs> like it, it, it doesn't. It sounds weird. It, exactly. Mm-hmm. Well, what Tom was saying is that hoping that the child doesn't become um, the other, the opposite sex. Mm-hmm. But if that, if the child becomes that or wants to be that, that, then choice, that, that that's choice. we're still exactly. going to accept it. Like mm-hmm. it's fine, you know. You're still my child, no matter what. But he just doesn't want it to do it to do it. Exactly. Did it die? But you, you know what I mean? Hopefully there's merit behind that. The kids are getting weaker. It got, it, uh, it lost sometimes. It loses. Bluetooth loses connection sometimes. Most controversial rapper right now might be Lil Nas X because of this, just the things that he's doing in his videos. Controversial topics might be Tom with what he talks about. Mm. Lil Nas X just goes for the shock value. And like, for, for what's what's weird? Like uh, when people, I definitely mean, has a god. I don't pledge. consider Nas X like even a rapper. He's just an artist that yeah. does different things. But it's like, but he wants to be known as a rapper. Remember, he got mad because his country music got taken off of the rap chart. That's like when freaking Doja Cat says, "Respect my pen." It's like, girl, you harmonizing in every fucking song. Yeah. What what pen are you, you, are you using? We heard your pen early, and then you disappeared. And yeah, you, you, got you got big notoriety. and then just started doing what everybody wanted you to do. But damn, 11 seconds, and Tom's already got it. Damn, candy. bro. Let's keep going. Transphobic if you want to, but one day I'll be a father, and I really hope my son don't grow up to be my daughter. I ain't trying to hurt your feelings. It should be a little thicker. That's the problem. Being honest, got them trigger. The kids are getting weaker because they're sheltered by society. Pumpkin spice Adam for seasonal anxiety. Wokeness has become a way to bully non-violently and cancel everyone without improving on the life we lead. Without- mm. Mm. See, I don't think the hip hop community is homophobic. No, I don't think the hip. I don't think hip hop culture is homophobic. I think you got some rappers who are. Yeah. Oh yeah, they're definitely. There's, there's rappers, and it's like. But just like there's movie stars that are, there's yeah. regular people that are. There's going to be people who don't agree with things like that everywhere. Some people take it to more extremes than others. Yeah. Like I think not only do you have rap artists who are homophobic, you have some fans are too. Mm-hmm. Oh yeah. You you and it's like, okay, you don't like the person, don't listen to the mm-hmm. music. But see, that's where it all comes back to. What they do in their bedroom has should have no bearing on your life. Exactly. Yep. As long as they're not throwing what they're doing in in your face. That's what, what I'm you saying. And, and 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 this is what I always say. Like, if you got a gay rapper, if they got bars, they got bars. They got exactly. bars. Yeah. It don't matter what they do at the end of the day. They got bars. See, I don't like Lil Nas X because he don't got bars. Nah, I just vibe to his song on the radio when I'm driving. That's depends all I on which do. one. Yeah, right? it depends. I'm not, I don't download. He does have like music that you vibe yeah. to. Yeah. But he's not have anything that you want to go out of your way to listen to. What up, Arjit? What up? But like, yeah, I don't, I don't have, I mean, I liked Old Town Road. Yeah. I liked that it. It was too. catchy. Like, yeah, it was for catchy, someone yeah. to say that was a terrible song, I'm like, no, it's not. You just don't want to admit that you liked it. Exactly. It was a catchy song. Right. It was, yeah. Even with Billy Ray Cyrus on it, it was still catchy. Yeah, that, that's what he does, though. Is, he, it, he, can, he can do that, and that's what Lil Nas X yeah. is good at. But I wouldn't classify him as a rapper. That's nah. why he's an artist. Nah. And it's not like you got to call the man top five. And stuff. No, it's he's like, not anywhere near He's that. not. It's just, who was this guy singing? Oh, this is Tom McDonald. This is Tom McDonald. Sorry, Sunshine. But yeah, like... Oh, they, 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 RG calls uh, Ian Ludacris. Yeah, <laughs> supposedly I look like Luda. I'll take it, though. <laughs> Go ahead, Tommy. Without the white, there's no black. Without the straight, there's no gay. Without the men, there's no women. Without the night, there's no day. Without the idiots, we couldn't laugh at them when they fall. So, so maybe we... He's got a point with that. Yeah. yeah it's true. Without each other, you don't be able to create nothing else. True. Right. True. Without individuality, you don't get a difference between anything. That's true. If everything is the same, why is there any discussion on anything? 
not everybody's gonna like everything all the same. Yeah, that's true. It's just like with the pronouns, like exactly that. It's like they don't wanna be called a male or a female. They just it's like it. I don't understand that. I don't get it. <laughs> don't have nothing against of what sex they want to be. It's just no. what you truly are. Mm-hmm. It, it's like when it's like when some dudes say like, "Oh, I'm not." Um, when they say that they they don't like, dislike gay people, it's just it's just something they don't like to see. That doesn't mean they're homo. They just they just not yeah. down with right. it. Exactly. It doesn't mean they're gonna spend all day hating on you. Mm-hmm. Yeah. They, they I mean, just. Long they as, prefer long man as and a woman. Yeah, like right. if I was a dude and 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 I and I'm gay, whatever, and I'm talking to you. Yeah. Right. Long as I'm respectful to you, you gotta talk to me. Yeah. That's it's like all the, about respect. That's like the whole stereotype when people think, oh, this dude, this dude's gay. He he must like me. Not every gay dude is attracted to every single man on right. the planet. Exactly. exactly. That's exactly. like saying every. That's like saying one woman is attracted to every, every single man that exists that on doesn't Earth. Work. Or it every doesn't, man's attracted to every single woman. Yeah, it, it doesn't, it doesn't work. work like that. No. Yeah. Because no matter each individual person has their preferences. Exactly. Mm-hmm. Exactly. That's what makes you you you. Pretty much. Unique. Yeah. Pretty much. Need them after all. <laughs> I like what he's saying. I don't like how he did it. Not gonna lie, his verses are nice. Mm-hmm. I'm not feeling this hook. No, not at all. That's what I said. I yeah, like what he's saying. I'm not, not how he's. I don't, I don't like how yeah. he's doing this. This this hook, he's done better hooks. Definitely. Yeah. I like the beat. Yeah, the beat the beats. I nice. like the beat. I don't like how he's attacking the beat. Yeah. He could have done this I've seen him do way better on beats yeah. like this. Mm-hmm. Oh We hate Tom McDonald. We hate Tom now. Oh Vito, we hate Tom McDonald. Oh. Wait, what? Oh God. Wait, somebody saying that? What? Oh, oh no, no! It not that we, not, no oh, no okay. one's saying it here, but every time like oh, yeah, ever right. since we did that, that's don't right. look down. Yeah, we don't. We don't the like entire that. Hangover Gang just thinks I we know. hate Tom McDonald. See, I, but the thing I like what he's saying. I like what he's talking about. Yeah, how it, he's. I just don't like how he's re- attacking the beat. I don't like his flow on this at all. I love the earth, but I don't really want to save it. Everyone's obsessed with making stupid people famous. If a white boy raps, then it's called appropriation. But Beyonce has a hair blonde, and people say she slayed it. Oh my god, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. you. I have been saying this for the longest time. Mm -hmm. I get tired of this crap every time a white woman. Post a picture on Instagram, okay, and our hair's braided. Black women and Hispanic, like, uh, I'm not saying all of you. Some black women and some black in Hispanic, y'all freak the hell out. Mm-hmm. There's nothing yeah. wrong with the white woman braiding her hair. No, there's nothing wrong with the white woman with dreads if it looks good on her. Like, if it looks good, yo, if that's it what looks they good. Like, if that's their preference, they'll let it but be. I think, even if I think it looks good. If she thinks it looks good on her, but what, I, a, it, but I what think, about, like, when black yeah. women put yeah, the like, blonde I, hair? I yep. think it's ridiculous when you got... It, it'd be the same black woman, okay? <laughs> Ian, calm down, she said. <laughs> <laughs> it, it, just, it, get, it, it just like, gets Ian going. It'd be the same black women who have an issue with white girls braiding your hair, but you're turning around and straightening your hair and blonding it. Yep. Shut up. Exactly. Like, yep. like you exactly. shut. That's hyper. Like, shut up. Yep. I hate. Oh my god, I hate that. Yep. I hate that. I oh, oh, it grinds my gears. Oh, and I'm not even a woman. Uh huh. And that pisses me off. Mm-hmm. <laughs> you know, automatically assume just because a white girl braided hair, she racist. Yep. No. Some white girls just look good with braided hair, bro. And again, whether you think it looks good or not, she enjoys like, it. That's what I'm saying. It's her head. That's what I'm saying. Exactly. What I'm, is what she does I'm, to her I'm hair? I'm sorry to say so this. Black women love y'all to death. Some of y'all don't look good with blonde hair. Some of y'all don't look good with it. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Hey, there's some white girls that don't look good with blonde e- exactly. hair. Exactly. Exactly. 
Oh my goodness. Oh my god. <laughs> I'm sorry, women. I know I'm, I'm not a woman. I'm sorry. I'm just, oh, I hate hypocrisy. Right. That's what I don't like. Yeah, me too. Raised, everybody's mad at solutions to the issues don't make no sense the stairs are the problem we build wheelchair ramps we don't cancel feet or persecute the people with legs the feminists wait, wait, we wait. don't cancel feet <laughs> <laughs> yo i love that feet you're done exactly no feet <laughs> he used a simple example but whenever there's a problem we find a solution to it we don't attack the things that can actually go up yeah. the stairs <laughs> just because there's a group of people that can walk up the stairs do we attack them and break all their legs so they can only use the ramp? Bro, my man <laughs> said cancel feet. <laughs> Everybody, you got to get rid of your feet. You got to get rid of your feet now. But I see what you're saying, Chop off at the knee. Yeah, just gone. Get rid of your feet. All right? Can't have feet now. No. Damn. Problem, we build wheelchair ramps. We don't cancel feet or persecute the people with legs. The feminists who started the movement would be ashamed of so many things. They thought so you can vote, I'll show your butthole on OnlyFans. I'm not a bad person, cause you don't like what I say. Call me homophobic just because I think straight. I love people even though we disagree. I wish we could get Wi Fi signals from a tree. And everyone would plant them, and we'd probably save the planet for free. Too bad we only need them to breathe. Oh. Ooh. 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 Too bad we only leave them to breathe. breathe. If well, the trees the gave up, should... yeah, exactly. Yeah. If trees gave up a Wi-Fi signal. People would be planting them left, right, and Bro, center. For re- exactly. You Bro. know how many people would be trying to patent Wi-Fi trees? Mm-hmm. But uh, people don't realize you need them to breathe. Granted, you don't need twenty trees for one person. True. You probably need one tree for twenty people, depending on the size of the tree. Dude. Freaking redwood might be able it's to... It's just f- like when they say like Amazon, Amazon is like the lungs. Mm-hmm. Mm. Well, the, what, is the Amazon uh, probably produces most of the world's freaking yeah, oxygen. Yeah, yeah. And forest. then they, they, they're killing trees. Mm. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Okay. Like they're fires. Bro, like... And not only I'm, that, but the people, the um, yeah. indigenous people, yeah, they're destroying their home. Uh, and Amazon, yeah. Do you mean Haley from, like, Eminem's daughter, Haley? What up, Ankar? See how you mean Eminem's daughter, Haley? Hola. It depends on what time. I, I do like Tom. I'm not really vibing to this song. It's I'm just, vibing yeah. to his message it's, more it's, than anything on it's, this. It's, the structure of the song. Right. I don't like. His, I don't like how he attacked this beat yeah. at all. I really don't. I like what he's saying yeah, and how it's, he's it's, saying it. Yeah. yeah, it's. So we're more reacting to what he's saying, but no, I'm not really yeah. vibing with this song. Um, quite honestly, M's daughter. Is M's daughter over? Is she, how old Haley. Is she? Yeah. How old is she now? She's yeah, she old she, now. She's legal now. I can yeah, say she, she's legal. Now. I'm not trying to be like MGK about here. No, you know no, no. She's legal now. I mean, she's, she's a gorgeous legal. girl. Yeah. I've seen pictures yeah, of her. Yeah, if she came out of nowhere and wanted to propose to you, be like, you're the one I want. And be like, that was easy. <laughs> <laughs> but I don't know. You'd have to go out and see what she's like first. Listen, bro. Honestly, mm-hmm. even if she got some crazy, I don't give a shit. I'll do it. <laughs> I'll do it. Because she, she done been through a lot. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. So she, she got some traumas. She probably got... You, you got, got some baggage. You got just some baggage. baggage. Yeah. I'll deal with your it. Your cap. Where's your cap? Uh, oh, shoot. Yeah, that's right. You're naked. That's I know. <laughs> it's like being, he'd have one hell of a father-in-law. Yeah. Dude. Oh my god. Dude. <laughs> Yo, I'd be trolling with M all day, man. <laughs> all day. You got him excited. All d- I'd be like, if 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 someone was like, um, invite me to a cook, I'd be like, I don't invite nobody. M invites everyone. Yeah. You mm-hmm. know. I'm lucky he even let me in. Hey, my, my, my father-in-law invited me to the cookout. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. I'm like, <laughs> all right, see y'all later. I'm going to M's cookout. <laughs> For real. Oh yeah, this is pretty much a one-time listen. Ian pretty. would be happy if M dis. Oh, I'd love if M dissed me. Oh, oh God. Ian would be like, I'm not no. Oh, oh, bro. <laughs> I talk my shit, though. Am I, I cause, important cause, to be dissed on? Because it's going gonna, it's gonna, to be, be whack, okay? Because I'm nowhere near Eminem's level of rapping or story. 
it's gonna be whack. But I'm gonna still try to get the best bars I can give. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> like it and might we, take me a little minute to write the thing. I, I'd have to be like Royce and take forever to write it. Yeah, but M gonna bury you. Bro, I think that they'd be a privilege. But you go into that knowing it. I'm sorry, but I don't think nobody can ever like this M because he already dissed on himself. Listen, for listen. one. It's that already is, all been M, done. M, I don't think M is considered a political rapper. He he raps about political issues. He his M, his, M is an all topics kind of rapper. Yeah, he's yeah. Just, he doesn't ignore any topic. Yeah, yeah. He's universal. Yes. Ain't nobody dumb That's the y'all. difference. Tom Ain't is considered dumb. like a political Look, yeah, rapper. Yeah, he's literally yeah. labeled a political yeah. rapper. I wouldn't consider M a political rapper. He talks about political issues, but he's oh. not a political rapper. Oh, he more he talks Damn. about what he has issues with. That's Yo, why he, somebody you know. a no name rapper punched Adam Calhoun, man. He actually punched him. Oh hell! Don't don't Adam Calhoun don't don't. We don't need Calhoun back in jail. We don't need that. Oh man. Luda will like to marry Lisa. Lisa. <laughs> I'm yo, ooh, Lisa Hand or he- <laughs> Hey, father-in-law M. <laughs> <laughs> Lisa Ann, though, she got money. But Haley, might just be. But Haley comes with M. Hey, you gotta go for the money. I gotta know the personality first. Gotta know the person. But hey, also, hey, look at it this way. You know everything that Lisa Ann can do. I'm sure you've seen it all. You don't know what Haley can do. She can do a lot, Liz. Yeah, but you don't know what Haley can do. <laughs> <laughs> Drew, I don't know what Haley can do. That could be fun exploring. I like a good adventure. Yeah, I'm not feeling this hook, I'm, bro. I'm not feeling the hook at all. I love the earth, but I don't really want to save it Classifying people by the sex and race degrades it But we still say straight white males are the worst of our population Guess the labels are okay of the Caucasian Our kids are living in the rooms, I swear we barely ever see them go yeah, You see, that, that is the problem Straight white males are not the biggest problem in this, in this world Is it me or does it feel like he's talking about the same shit he said on Snowflake? Pretty much it's just a different way. It's pretty much on any of his things, though. It's just re-attacking that subject with different yeah. subjects. That's what I've been noticing. But see, it's depending on what group you're in. It's all about what your piece of shitness level is. <laughs> Let the church say amen, Vito. Let the church matter. say amen, It doesn't matter if you're a single white male or a straight white male. or you're sh- <laughs> It doesn't matter. <laughs> If Sun- your piece of shitness level's really high, Sunshine, you're gonna I be an never, asshole. I can never replace you, Sunshine. Uh, this this is just my, uh, you know what? I'll consider it my toxic masculinity talking. <laughs> <laughs> By society standards, I'll consider it that. But you know, it it doesn't. People want to sit there and say that the, the straight white male is the worst. No, it doesn't. There Dude, is no worst. There's some straight black men I can't stand. Yeah. <laughs> like, I, I, I'm sure there's I'm sure there's an evil gay white guy out there or an evil gay black dude out there. It doesn't yeah. matter what your sexual preference is to make you a bad be person. Wrong on each, right? Yeah, an evil person is going to do evil things. That's true. A bad person is going to do bad things. That's true. That's fact. Because again, it's all about what your piece of shitness level is. Everybody's got one. Yeah. Some mm-hmm. some people's piece of shitness level is real low. Mm-hmm. True. Sums are through the roof. Everybody, every guy, everybody has some asshole on them. They do. Everybody yeah. does. Everybody does. It's just what's your level of assholeness, pretty much. True. Hey, much love, sunshine. Side sometimes. There's fresh air you can be breathing. Put your phones down. Play sports. Do something illegal. Go and meet your families. They're probably nice people. These days you're a Nazi if you don't hate the police. They say that white folks think all Asian people are Chinese. I'm sorry. What kind of white people you mean? English, Scottish, German, Swedish, or Greek. And Black Lives Matter was problematic. It excludes anyone without the pigment. It's automatic. I understand all the reasons it happened, but including all humans is the actual answer. <laughs> Did you get that yeah, part? Oh, yeah. I said it from the when start. When they said with the white people? Yep. Because it is all different um, race. Yes. There's so actually, are you mean American Americans? or you? What, there's what, actually, what? like, we even did, like, a uh, 
like a genetics like my dad did it for our, his side of the family there's actually a shit ton of European in us we have German Scottish and British all in yeah, us yeah we're a mix like yeah. Most I have black. I'm sure of that. Most people are mixed. Yeah, I even have um Filipino in me. Where th- our race is so old at this point that there's no pure. Yeah, there's no pure. Like are. when people exactly. say, "Oh, pure white, pure," that shit don't exist, no. man. No. I highly doubt there's very few like pure German. That's things. what I'm saying. You're gonna sit there and tell me in your ancestor history they didn't stretch out. There ain't nobody that went and slept with none then. <laughs> right, you're going to guarantee me nobody, that your line is nobody got a, Nobody no. got a little curious 250 yeah. years ago. No. No. Yeah. <laughs> so, Come on. You said even back at, even back, way back, back when people then, had slave masters did slaves. stuff with their slaves. Yeah. Exactly. That's all I was going to... So, Everybody's mixed, bro, somehow. Yeah. Somebody's got more than one thing in them. Exactly. And it, the sad part so is you know most what? of the stuff that people hate is probably in them. Honestly, exactly. Honestly. That, I was just gonna. Would you stop getting into my head? I was just gonna say that too. <laughs> That's why you're my fiance. <laughs> it's like let's just say if Ian hated white person, then he's hating himself too because I'm sure he has a little bit of white. In well, he's got some, he's got German in him. I got, I got, I got German, German exactly. British, Scottish. Yeah. Exactly. But so so you got a lot of white. Think, you got a lot of white people. Don't think about yeah. that. A lot of white people. The good ones. I love black people. The, <laughs> the good, good ones. ones. I love Hispanic people. The, the good, good ones. ones. You know what? I love good people. Exactly. There you go. Let the church say there amen. There you go. All right. Let's go. If your piece of shit this level's low, I'll vibe with you. <laughs> yeah, for real. <laughs> Ain't nobody dumber than y'all. Ain't nobody dumber than y'all. Dude, the hook is like... It's, I don't need to be disrespectful, but the hook is like itchy. It's like it doesn't feel complete. Right. Yeah. It's like he wanted to do something different yeah. but with this. Yeah. The new album See, September oh, 3rd. Oh, there you go. It. There you go. That's com- uh, confirmation oh, right okay. there. Yeah. yeah. But yeah, I liked what he was talking about, not how he talked about it. Yeah. Uh, what are your thoughts on Lord Jamar talk? Take about nobody in the hood bumps Eminem. That's a lying ass shit. That's because I've seen interviews where people who came from the projects of Detroit said all they listened to growing up was, was M. M. Yeah. So that's some bullshit. That's some bu- um, and I'm, I, I know people that grew up in New York listening to 50. You tell me you grew up listening to 50, never bumped them. Even yeah, people that's who, what say I'm M, who say 50 is their bro, favorite rapper, you tell me you never once listened to them. Bro, you'll be, you'll be surprised. Like, when they say, like, oh, the people who live in the country, bro, there's people who live in, like, deep south in Alabama who all they listen to is Pac. Yep. If It's just what they like. Mm-hmm. mm-hmm. Like, you know what I'm saying? But what do I think about Indian girls? Oh, I vibe with Indian girls. Do y'all think Indian ladies? That's it, it, what's up. Again, good. We vibe with good people. That's what I'm saying. The house, house of burnt by Isaiah Rashad's new album was really good. He probably got white. I do got white in me. I got Caucasian in me. It don't mean I'm less black. Like I'm. Yeah, which way is the bathroom? Is the bathroom? Okay, so when you go into this door. <laughs> It's the first door on the right. I'll be right back, guys. Coffee got went right through me. Oh, it happens to be too, man. So yeah, go right in, and then the first on the right, man. But yeah, we can um, keep talking and everything. Um, I, I Dante, I agree with you. When I put when I chop this up and make it a reaction video, Hog is gonna be all the frick over us. I like the verses in this song, however. I was not feeling the hook. Not only that, but it's just a repetitive thing. Yeah. yeah I was starting to notice with uh, with Tom. It's just he just puts it the same thing in a different sauce. If you it, get what I'm saying. Like how I said, like it, he said some of the similar things in the song Snowflakes. Exactly. Yeah. But yeah. then, but not only that, uh, uh, was it Fake Woke on that one too? Yep. Okay. It, it's just he just has he a had little another bit. Another one before Snowflakes. I just forget the name. He has it. like. Um, I call it. He has a little bit of different topics, just only a little bit, but it's but the majority of it is almost the same thing. It's recycled. Mm, okay, just, yeah. Just, just um, okay. I using, see what you mean. Just being uh, using different words, but it's recycled. No, I'm. Oh, you meant oh, J- Jamal? <laughs> I mean, 
My bad. I mean, Jamar probably probably do got some white in him. Was this the first time he's in your house? Yeah. Um. The it's not the first time he's been to my house. Um. This is Liz's first time in my place. Yes. So this this is the really their first time like being inside of it. They've dropped me off before and stuff, but this is like their first time like in. The Ian residence. <laughs> <laughs> I like how he talks with his body. <laughs> yep. Talks like an Italian. Yeah. I <laughs> do. For, maybe. You, you got some, some Italian. Italian. Maybe. Italiano. <laughs> but yeah, I mean, overall, I like the content. He was trying to, he was trying to tell ignorant people you're being right. ignorant. Right. Pretty much. He's like, trying to say you're being right. stupid. Well, everyone, hope you enjoyed that reaction. Thanks for stopping and spending some time with us today. Like, comment, subscribe, blow us up. Y'all know what to be doing. Hit that notification bell. Give this a share because it does help the channel out. Hope everyone enjoyed it. And hey, we'll see y'all in the next one. Later, y'all.